homemade macro-friendly sweet and sour chicken in about 25 minutes. To make it, start out with half a sweet onion, a red and green bell pepper cut into about one inch pieces, and a pound of these lightly breaded chicken breast chunks from Costco. Purdue Farms also makes a great option. We'll air fry for about eight minutes at 350, and while that cooks, we'll prep our sweet and sour sauce with an eight ounce can of pineapple chunks and juice, a tablespoon of low sodium soy sauce and honey, three tablespoons of rice vinegar, a fourth cup of sugar-free or reduced sugar ketchup, We'll mix that together before adding two teaspoons of cornstarch to thicken everything up. Should look just like this. At this point, the chicken should have a few minutes left, so we'll add this to a pan over medium heat and reduce to a thick syrupy mixture that looks something like this. Once our chicken is crispy golden brown and the veggies are tender crisp, we'll add those to the sauce. I have some notes at the link in the description about using a single basket air fryer if you don't have two racks like this. So we'll add everything to the sauce, stir everything together until it's evenly coated. If you like a spicier sweet and sour chicken, you could add some chili flakes here or even serve with chili oil. You could also add toasted sesame seeds and then serve with rice or cauliflower rice. This recipe makes six servings, about six ounces each, and they'll have 200 calories, 15 grams of protein, 22 grams of carbs, and six fats.